trust me that is the most important if there's one tip that i can leave you with in this video it's that today i got four tips for you on how you can boost your instagram presence improve your engagement followers likes saves everything as a personal brand now this can also work for niche theme pages but i'm gonna focus on a personal brand today a bit more you can still definitely utilize this whichever kind of page you have okay it doesn't matter it's good what up people my name is frank and i make music industry and social media marketing related videos helping artists and brands reach that next level in their career as fast as possible and today like i said we're talking about instagram instagram is definitely always changing it can kind of be hard to catch up to actually you know be in the moment and not miss out on anything because there's always some new features new changes to the algorithm it's stuff is always happening so today we got four tips for you tip number one is post engaging content now this may sound obvious to you but what i mean by engaging content is content that people can actually engage with they can comment on and you, you can start a conversation with now you probably noticed when you're scrolling through the Instagram app that there is this new option of seeing suggested posts. Once you've seen all the posts from the people you're following, uh, Instagram su just suggests posts that things you, you will like, right? And why that is important is if you're posting engaging content, if people are liking your content, commenting on it, uh, starting conversations, uh, Instagram is much more likely to put one of your posts in that suggested feed. The only thing that Instagram actually cares about is keeping people on Instagram, right? So the longer time you spend on Instagram, the better it is for them. So if you're posting engaging content that people can comment on, that people can start conversations with, it's a much bigger chance for Instagram to suggest your post right there below your followers posts because, well, you're keeping people on the app. By the way, guys, if you find this video helpful, please consider subscribing, hitting that like button and that belly bell thing because it's a new channel and it will really mean a lot. Thank you. Tip number two is utilize IGTV as much as possible. You probably already know that the only place you can leave a clickable link on the Instagram app itself is in your bio. Now, if you have more than 10,000 followers, you can also have that swipe up option for stories and you can leave a link there. But if you don't have more than 10,000 followers, the only place for a link is in your bio, unless you're using IGTV, because as of recently in IGTV description, you can actually leave a clickable link as well. So that is quite important. Now, once you post an IGTV video, you can actually post a 15 second preview to your profile and to your followers feed which is going to prompt them to after watching that 15 second video to watch the rest on igtv and once they click that it's going to take them to igtv and you can leave a clickable external link there right one more important thing about instagram tv is that aside from leaving a clickable link in your igtv you can actually have a swipe up option in your story for your igtv video regardless of the follower count that you currently have right so what that means is you can actually link your igtv video on your story and have that swipe up option for people to actually go and watch that IGTV video. That's cool, right? You would like me to make a quick video on how you can link your IGTV video to your story and have that swipe up option. Leave a comment below and I'll make sure to make one ASAP. Okay, now we're gonna get to tip number three, which is quality over quantity. Now, there's a lot of debate on how much you need to post on Instagram. Should you post once a day, three times a day? Is once a week enough? Is a few times a week enough? You know, people have different opinions on, on, on that. But going into 2021, it's definitely much more important to have quality content than to have a million posts a day. Because like I said before, engagement is the number one thing for 2021 on Instagram. Now, if you post a picture of your dog or like a beautiful sunset, I understand that it's beautiful to you personally personally but there's not a lot of ways that a person can engage with that they're probably gonna like the post and that's it maybe leave a comment saying beautiful or something like that but you you're ending the conversation there and what's important is to continue that conversation so make a post whenever you have something to say don't just post for the sake of posting because that's going to destroy your reach because people are gonna, not going to engage with it so much and instagram is going to cut your reach down a lot so post engaging content quality over quantity make sure you put time and work in every post so it, it looks more engaging and therefore is more engaging i guess and tip number four also has a lot to do with engagement but this time it's engaging with your audience again this is probably obvious to you 
first of all definitely respond to every single comment now that can that is common knowledge by now you should definitely respond to every single comment but the way you respond to comments it's definitely very very important because if someone leaves a comment on one of your posts and you just say thank you or appreciate it or whatever it is just just drop a fire emoji or a thumbs up emoji or anything like that you're ending the conversation there what's important is that you actually build connection with these people and turn them from followers to fans now how do you do that you actually become interested in them because these are people this is a social media for the be social that is the most important thing be social ask a question if someone leaves a comment you can say oh thank you where are you from or thank you what do you do Oh really you're from Italy I've been to Venice last year it's I hear it's amazing like whatever oh you're a lawyer that's cool my sister's a lawyer like whatever just make them remember you because that's how you make friends actually and if you make friends with these people they're much more likely to actually click on your post to actually engage with your post the next time you post it because well you're friends and you just get to know them actually build a real connection with these people be genuine and build a real connection don't just respond because someone on a youtube video told you to respond because that's going to help your engagement no actually make a connection with these people and that's going to make a world of difference trust me that is the most important if there's one tip that i can leave you with in this video it's that make connection with people and actually care about them provide value and they will give you value in return and that is just human nature just be social act social make friends be a genuine person and it's gonna be a huge difference that's it guys four easy tips on how you can boost your instagram presence today let me know if you like the video let me know in the comments if you're utilizing one of these strategies if you already did it what was the outcome and everything i really want to know so shoot me a comment below if you want to check out another one of my videos, I'm going to leave them linked in the description. I got a lot of music industry advice videos for independent artists in the 2020 coming and going into 2021. So be sure to check that out if you're inter interested. Thank you for watching, guys. My name is Frank. You can follow me on Instagram at Franklin Blunt. Hit that subscribe button and bell and like and everything. And I'll see you in the next video next week. Peace.